Hey, this is Charlie with CD Paving and Seal Coat. We are here in Meridian, Texas at the old Sundown Ranch. It's an old blacktop road that we're going to be putting a tar and chip and seal on top of. This asphalt has been here for quite a number of years. It's been patched and it's been seal coated. It's been maintained well over the years, but it's seen its better days. And the owner of the ranch wanted to put a chip and seal down on his road. He feels like it's time to get something new and fresh and of course, we're chip sealing it for a lot cheaper than what you can blacktop it for, and it's well beyond a seal coat and patch. So we're coming in here and we're gonna prep the ground, we're gonna do some patchwork to it, and then we're gonna put the armor coat on it, we're gonna put the chip and seal. A layer of hot CRS2, followed by a layer of the 3 8 pea gravel, then roll the compaction, and it's gonna look like a beautiful new ranch style road, done by CD Paving and Seal Coat. Here we go! So how we go about starting a project like this is once we get our equipment all parked and situated, we evaluate the type of dirt and cleaning that needs to happen to the parking lot. We chop back any grass or weeds that's growing up through the edges. Then we do any chopping and spraying of herbicide on top of it and we send our blower guys in there and they're going to blow any loose debris or settlements on the pavement off and they're going to get it as clean as possible so we can do whatever patchwork we got to do to it first. Once all the blowing is done, then we'll bring in our gravel and park it on a good spot. And then we'll start our pre-chip sealing or patching process. And that consists of spraying down the tar in areas that we want to bring up to par with the rest of the blacktop driveway. So as you can see, our man is spraying that tar in, in certain areas just to get it up to patch and then he'll spread gravel on those areas. And once the patches are in, it's not gonna look beautiful, but it's just to get everything up to par so we can put our final coat on top of everything. So as you can see, that's what the crew is doing right now. And once these areas are completely patched and taken care of, then our asphalt distributor comes in and it'll start shooting down a nice thick layer of the hot CRS2 on top of the road. Once that tar is sprayed on top of the road, then we come back in and we spread down our 3 8 pea gravel chip rock on top of it. And that provides the armor coat on top of the driveway. And as you can see, the chip spreader casts a nice even layer of chips on top of the road. Then our rake guys come in and they'll start raking in all the areas where some of the black tar is still exposed. And they'll get it nice and level and clean before the roller man comes in and starts to put the final roll on top of the driveway. On a good portion of this driveway, the chip ceiling has been completed. We've shot the tar, we've spread the rock. Now the guys are coming in and they're doing some fine tuning raking, just knocking out all the roughed up areas and getting a nice smooth surface on top of it and then our roller man is coming in and he's rolling down the rocks into the tar and getting a good compaction and this is all part of the chip and seal process on this ranch road and so we continue on shooting tar and spreading our rock and getting everything completely finished once all the chip seal is completely shot and all of the driveway is covered our guys will come in and they'll do a final punch out. This is where they tie in some of the corners or if another area might need to be made a little wider or if it may need a little bit more tar or a little bit more gravel. It's just a final punch out. It gets everything completely pulled together for the final end product. And so we are completely finished out here at the old Sundown Ranch. This old blacktop road got cleaned it got the grass and the weed sprayed with herbicide. We came in and we patched it with a pre-course of chip seal by coming off over the bad areas, the low areas, the chugged out areas, spraying down hot CRS2, spreading the rock, rolling it down to compaction, and then we followed up with putting a whole new coating of the chip seal on top of the whole driveway. Hot CRS2 followed by the gravel, rolling it down to compaction. What once was an old blacktop road here at this ranch is now a new chip seal driveway. So on your chip seal roads 
old chips hill roads, blacktop roads, or just a gravel road, you can put your tar and chips hill down over on top of it in any location in Texas, Oklahoma, or New Mexico. Make sure and call CD Paving and Seal Coating. So take a ride with me back into this ranch as I show you what these roads look like before. Old blacktop, cracked up, grass growing through the sides. We chopped back the grass and weeds, we cleaned it, then we patched it. We patched it with a chip and seal, then we came in and we put down a final chip and seal on top of everything. And what was once an old blacktop road is now a new chip seal road. The look of this chip and seal really fit in beautifully with this particular range. Everything was very much country, very rustic. There was beautiful trees everywhere and it was well kept. Now, the road blends in with the rest of the property. As you can see, it has a very natural country look to it, a very landscape appearance. And the maintenance work that you would have had to have done with blacktop, now you don't have to do anymore with the chip and seal. It's just more of a enjoy what you have type of driveway now. And as you can see, it adds a nice, strong armor coat to the drive. So whether you got a parking lot, driveway, or a ranch road, make sure and call CD Paving and Seal Coating today.